home. So I welcome to another episode of Whiskey Sour Libations and Conversations. Um, I I am very confused. Uh, I have two amazing people this week. Uh, and I'm really <laughs> no, we're gonna go right into the bullshit. First of all, for the people watching, the person that has on a Cavaliers hat that's from St. Louis, yeah, is sleep. Born and raised, baby. St. Louis is old, man. Is I mean, I don't know if I should can I say your government name or no? Oh, you can. Yeah, okay, hello, ahead. Eric Dillard. Hey, how you I can't believe I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I met you at we went to college together at many moons ago. Many, many moons ago. And they were like, Oh, this is sleepy. I'm like, okay, what's his name? I didn't so use I think I found name. out your name in on like Facebook. I didn't use a real name for a long time. I just went by my, my nickname. <laughs> Guy and was, I I yeah, I only clearly. white only white folks, my teachers, uh <laughs> the police would call me Eric. But yeah, if you call me Eric, I was usually in trouble. <laughs> Just the room real quick, because you know it's calves. There we go. Okay, great. But you not but so so keep that energy when we go on this run. I don't okay. want to see I don't want to see no Laker posts. I don't want to see no Laker IG stories, Facebook, Twitter, none of that. I want no, 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 no! Don't, don't, don't do it! Don't even do it! You went at Kobe's because you bought him, bro. Don't be that guy. It's can I? He recorded. It's like you see that red thing that says live. That means she recorded. You fraud! Don't come to the crib, bro. Kobe will hunt you, bro. Kobe will hunt you. We don't want you, bro. Still, we're, we're not gonna do that. LeBron okay. has the Kobe okay. tattoo. How you feel? And, and, and that sound that you guys are listening to and or watching at the bottom is Doja. <laughs> I don't think I ever met Doja in real life, by the way. Uh, it'd be like that. Sometimes you become like cool with people. That's the cool wow. thing about social media. Yeah. Thanks. So I like. I feel like I've maybe seen him about St. Louis, possibly, but I was college was so quick, and then I was just gone. So I don't, I don't understand how y'all never met. Like I don't get it. I just uh, so no. okay. So <laughs> we're just confused as to how you're a Cavaliers fan and LeBron isn't even there anymore, or Kyrie, Kevin see. Love. What was the one dude that okay. was really good that one season? They went to the finals. Name, go say name. Uh, <laughs> Della Dova. Uh <laughs> okay. Okay. Hey, excuse my back, bro. Can y'all give me a back, moment? Back. I'm away. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 no. She got you. Go ahead. You got it. Yeah. I'm pulling out the window. I'm pulling out the window. Miss Howard. Okay. So I am born and raised here in St. Louis, Missouri. Oh, yes. I am St. Louis from head to toe. St. Louis doesn't have a basketball team like we don't. Now, most folks from St. Louis, we don't fool with nothing from Chicago. We don't like the Cubs. We don't like the White Sox. We don't like the Bulls. I have family who lives in, in Ohio. So I've been a Cavaliers fan before LeBron was a thing, like before he was on the team. I, I didn't even know who LeBron was. Stay there. I didn't Price. know who they were before no, LeBron. No, Mark Price, Craig Elo, Brad Doherty. Like That's I'm showing my age right now. I've been a Cavs fan since the, 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 since the late mm -hmm. 80s. Early nineties. Congratulations. So, nigga, you forty? Yeah, hey, we out here. What you mean? <laughs> I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be there in May, bro. I'm gonna be yeah, there in May. Wait, why? He, why you do the hand clap like you finna roll up on me? Yeah, in like, bro, we like, outside, bro. We outside. I'm so confused. Oh Let's my god, you know, age though. I just, that, was, that was real ages right there. Like, yes, I, I am happy to be forty. Yeah, you with the ages. That was real ageist. No, was my like, boss yeah. said that I was ageist one day. And I told him, I said, That's no, amazing. I am telling you an experience that I've had with a certain age bracket of people, and now you're gaslighting me. Ooh. So Wait a flip it. Flip, hey, that's a good flip. <laughs> is he white? He is. That's, hey, that's a good flip. That's right. that's that's good. Hey, hey. Yeah. But no, that's so LeBron made the Cavs relevant to the country, but like I've been a Cavs fan. Like, stay there. Just stay there. No, no. Don't no. see. Don't see. Stay there. 
can I can I can I speak? Greg, Greg, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna just Greg. LeBron left Cleveland, but he bought us a ring. So I will always have love for LeBron. So now he's in LA, and I'm gonna be real. I know my team is not gonna win a championship anytime soon. We ain't got nothing like we got. Stay there. But we're playing real good this year. Cool. Like we're playing real good. So I'm I'm a rep always. I got you know, it's whatever. Dozier is a Lakers fan, but he hates LeBron. So he's in a real mm-hmm. awkward situation. Don't, don't, don't bring me, don't bring me in this. Don't bring me in this. This is your, bro. this is your, this is your, 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 your story. This bro. is your time. Bro. Bro. Mm. No. Bro. I'm good. You're being I'm real right. bad right now, man. I'm like, right, bro. You're I'm being right. real beige. You're being I'm real beige. Right. I'm right. You know where I'm at. Okay. But, okay. So, so how, how, okay. So why you hate LeBron? Listen, man. I, listen, I rock with LeBron as a black man outside, outside of the basketball court. What he is doing is is beautiful. I think that I think that he gets, I think he gets the right amount of publicity for what he's doing for like for like the black people, right? But for, on the basketball court, like like, bro, like his finals record is trash. He got swept by the Warriors. We never talk about that. That that just gets just gets. Just nobody talks about that. He got swept. Um, and then this this whole facade about like people have to play up to LeBron versus sometimes you just gotta look at look at just it, it might just be LeBron. Like you feel what I'm saying? Like me personally, I'm 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 be for real. Like A D, that's that's what we needed. I ain't really rock Westbrook. We needed A D, right? LeBron, I mean, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? But without AD, you ain't doing none of this. So you know what I'm saying? I, I feel personally we could we could be we could be good without King James. But I mean, you know, that's for another day. That's for another day. But listen here though, I'm gonna say this. I've been a legacy. Like when we were sucking, when Kobe was like going like like 12 for 40 shots, I was still waving my flag. I was still waving my flag. And this man up here, hold on, what's that he on? He over here on this side. Yes, this man was all on his LA fakers and Kobe Bryant is weak and all that. Remember that? Remember that? It's a thread. It's on social media, bro. You said that. So stay away. Don't I, I said, come over there. Listen, I, I said when we, go, when we go on this twenty game run, bro. Don't 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 come don't come to Staples. You're not welcome. You have Russell Westbrook on your team. It's not gonna be a twenty game run. And the LeBron is hurt. Right? And LeBron yeah. hurt. I mean, no, 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 no. I don't. I, I'm okay. I get everybody wants to come home, but I think that there is. Okay, so <laughs> I forgot that the dog was in here for a second. I just jumped. Um, but I, I don't, I, I don't know stats. I don't know. I am a spectator, so I can't go back and forth with you about certain things. But what I see. Yeah, my thine eyes don't deceive me. Russell yeah. Westbrook has played the same since the Sonics to OKC. Wasn't he in Houston oh, for a hot second? She's talking about us. And she know about him with the body sleep. She's trying to come and with us. So I'm that's all I'm saying. So she, I think she, that she, she, she's jaded though, because she's a Durant fan. So of who course said that? Uh, I follow you on social media. I know. Uh, so no, 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 no. But that has that has nothing to do. That has not. He plays the same everywhere. Russell Westbrook is is for oneself. He is all about individualism. And so I feel like sometimes you about to make me defend Russell. God. No, I think he's great. I think he's an I, he's a nice guy. No, 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 no. I'm not going back and forth. But this is the same thing. The people, man. The same thing. Trade for him. Trade for him. Trade for him. We'll give it to you. You can have him. Exactly. You see. Wow. We don't need him. We don't need Westbrook. Nigga, I encounter Lakers fans like every couple of paces I walk. These niggas ain't that happy about him being here. But he does. So you got the he there. Cards you dealt. Okay. He I, 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 I just, again, I don't have hey, a team. I hey, spectate. You got the I enjoy, I enjoy the game of basketball. I enjoy going to games. 
That is all. Russell Westbrook got to just be a six man. All right, so. No, no, you know what? We're not gonna you gotta be a six man. I'm gonna be, gotta be a six man. Listen, I'm, listen. Well, someone should have told Hall James Harden that and stayed in OKC. He played with Hall of Famers. Listen, for every Jordan, there gotta be a Barkley. He just gonna have to. Be I do. I, everybody can't be a star, though. I don't think without yes. Doja, Doja. Everybody can't be a star, and everybody well, don't real, understand that concept. I'm being serious. Tell you me I'm lying. Tell me I'm lying. Tell me I'm lying. He played. He played with. He played with uh with, with uh with Harden when they was doing their thing in, in uh in uh, uh uh Houston. Now, granted, James Harden didn't want to come to the practices, and he was showing up late and shit. Okay, whatever. He then won't he be did, there. He won't be there. Then you then he played with uh he played with uh Chris. Paul. He was in D.C. Chris Paul and them. Yeah, he played with Chris Paul. Then he played with uh with uh with D and D.C. Now, granted, I think D.C. would have been a better fit. I think you would have had you would have had uh him Bill, you know, cooler bench. They could have worked that out. But you know, LA is LA. But my thing is, you you listen, we don't somebody need to tell him we don't need you to be OKC Russ. He got that already. Just just be aggressive on defense, play your role. He ain't he ain't tuned into playing his role, right? No, it's 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 just not happening. Bring because individualism. That's oh all. my god, Lord y'all boy. I mean he's an MVP. He a walking triple double, but that don't mean you for to get wins. See, I'm walking Charles Barkley Hall of Famer. Do Charles Barkley got a ring? No. Chris Webber. Do Chris Webber got a ring? Bro. Not no, he, he does ring. not. So every era, there has to be somebody who just, hey, yo, they was, they was, they was. That lead. might be, but that also might be Chris Paul. <sighs> what are we doing right now? Yeah, <laughs> Come on, I, did, I did it. It was we, just we can do this. We can we go. Just, no, I don't want to do this because I, I am just like the, the, the. If this is what is this show with uh oh with Shannon God. and them, and then I'm just like the spectator oh, girl that's God. sitting there being cute. I don't know all these stats and numbers, and I'm, I'm honest saying, about that. I'm the spectator girl just being cute. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You, you, you're, you're, you're causing, causing chaos is what you're doing. You're causing chaos. But it's cool. I'm not. I didn't start it. You did with the hat. You know what I'm saying? I can't wear a hat. Ooh. In my home? I'm, I'm at home. That is. Like, I, hello. <laughs> she getting at his ass. Yeah. I, I, I just, that's all I'm saying. saying. Like, you brought it. So I was confused. I was like, wait a second. Maybe, maybe I missed something. I figured maybe you was from Ohio and I missed that. And talking to you, the brief conversations I've had with your sister in college. So I thought I missed something. So I, I, I did live in Ohio for seven years. So I mean, how miserable was that? <laughs> like eight years ago? I ain't been home. I ain't been back in St. Louis that long. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say it's been, it's been, how long was it? Long anyway. Was it? Anyway, hi guys, welcome to the show. Thank you. Oh, damn. That, okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, how you doing? <laughs> Happy to be here. Y'all, y'all started it. I you know just saying? engaged I'm a little chilling. bit. I'm chilling. I'm just saying, stay in Cleveland. Stay in Cleveland. <laughs> and then I guess Sleep got upset and he just left. He Hopefully off. he will tap you did it to back my dog. in. You did it to my dog. He jumped out. I don't know if he go tap back in. Let me see what, let me see what he, got, he got going on. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there he is. Hold on. Hold on. There he is. Ring back in. Hey. Y'all sound was messed up. I was like, I had to reset. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that what it is? That's that's, that's what we're doing? That's what we're doing? No, I don't hey. know. It could have been mine. I just had to reset. I said, let me, you know. Listen, Kobe, the, the spirit of Kobe got in your, got in your shit. And it was like, nah, you're not going you to disrespect me, dog. You're being you know, disrespectful. You know what, man? Kobe, I, I, you know what? I got love for Kobe, man. Girl, dad, just like myself. So, you know, R.I.P. Kobe. Y'all, the like world, the world ain't been right since that morning. Thank you. The world is not right. as soon as Kobe died. Covid happened. I don't know. Well, Kobe what? was Covid was happening before. We just had a okay. Hold on. maybe it okay. was maybe maybe stronger. It went to a stronger level. Um, Kobe I mean, was might. Disrespectful, bro. You disrespectful. Don't disrespect I did, me, bro. Did I not yeah. just say? the details of, of, of the conversations that you had about Kobe, bro. This well, I, I, all I was going to say is this, is that I... A king. 
King I Kobe. stopped being big on conspiracy theories, but now I'm big on conspiracy theories. And there's some weird thing, energy that was let out into the universe, and the, the life ain't been right since then. You know what I'm saying? I'll, I'll allow it. I, and, I and, it and what's really weird, what the, where I, I saw my like best friend tweet it, right? And I'm like, wait, what? So I'm thinking maybe sudden heart attack, if this is true, maybe a car accident, not helicopter. Yeah. And when I told y'all that morning, it was hella fucking foggy outside. Like we yeah. had a week yeah. of just, it looked like, even last week, it just looked like the movie The Fall. Like you just, it was thick. Mm. And to hear, and, and how, you know, elevation and shit is. So like in Newport, it could have been clear. Mm. And then you come out this way and it's completely different. I have had beach days where I'm like, oh, okay, I'm gonna go kick it at the beach. And it's like gloomy as shit. Mm. So I, I don't know, that shit was just weird and it was that was hard. It was it was just, it, 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 was, was, it was hard for everybody. It was it was it was a, a really weird situation because Kobe like he Kobe and that's like Jordan is Jordan. I was a kid for Jordan and he retired oh, like know. I was still young when Jordan retired. Thanks. But like Kobe, I felt I watched him, you know, yeah, get drafted. I watched him struggle, I watched him triumph. I watched him take the game to a to a different level. So, and then what he off the court, like like grown old man Kobe, he was such an ambassador for being a girl dad, mm. and he was so I don't know, I, his his career was fantastic, but even post career, yeah, what he was doing was really dope. So to, to see him, it actually did mess me up. You yeah. don't have to love somebody on the court to respect them. And no, Kobe was not my favorite basketball player, but when it came to like. What he did for the game and what he did post uh, retirement, like he's definitely missed. Yeah, I think it was the, this interview that I saw with Ahmad Rashad um, that made me really kind of like respect and enjoy Kobe. Um, and being able to go to some games before he ultimately retired was just like amazing. And it was just, I mean, the city is finally starting to feel kind of like, okay, this feels like LA again, but baby, the city was sad. How did you guys know where? How was it out there? LA is great. Uh, I, I've i been out here for 11 years. And <laughs> yeah, I've been gone from St. Louis 11 years. I just celebrated my 11 year uh, anniversary. Uh, got trashed at a bar down the street. Um, shout out to being trashed. I thought he was about to say shout out to being trashed. I was like, hold the fuck up. No. <laughs> cause sleep, sleep made a face too. Cause I was like, no. Nah, what you're not gonna do is come on my platform yes. and try to insult me no, because no, baby, no, I got no, receipts no. on you. No smoke. Whoa. I don't want no smoke. <laughs> Okay. Oh, no smoke. I'm gonna be. I'll be the moderator. Everybody, calm down. <laughs> peace. Everybody, just relax. Just relax. No, um, <laughs> but LA has been uh, great. There has been tremendous highs, you know, lows, and overcoming adversity just to be a better person. You know, um, I'm really enjoying the person that I'm becoming. And um, just kind of walking in my purpose and walking by faith and not by sight and trusting the Lord and the universe. Uh, and I know everything that I am deserving of um, is coming to me because I am working for it. So, yeah, LA has been cool. Well, no. Uh, one, congratulations. <laughs> I've known you for a um, Shit, a long ass time now. Seeing yeah. you grow up, I can say that. Seeing you grow up to the young lady that you've become. Yeah, because nigga, you old. Fantastic. Hey, I am, but you. No, you I'm gonna stop. Me. I'm gonna stop saying that. You only five years older than me. You're not about to say you're not a spring chicken, baby. You. About to be on the other side of thirty-five in a minute. <laughs> I'm embracing it, dog. I'm embracing turning forty. Like I turned forty in May. I got a list of shit I want to do. What are you, a Pisces? No, uh, a Taurus? Yeah, yeah. I can see that. Because you ain't no Gemini. What? 
I, I don't I don't sense air from you. So that's why I was like, oh, you probably like a Taurus. Why y'all why y'all so spicy against each other? Come back. I, I, I don't know. Spicy. Everybody's spicy today. I come, I I come in peace. peace. I come in peace. Listen, man. I am ready to turn it for you though, because like I got a list of shit I want to do. Mm -hmm. One, one is gonna be mastering how to play a piano. Um, two is gonna be jumping out of a plane. Okay, so we don't care. I'll turn his mic off. <laughs> My man. I'm just playing. Down. I'm just playing. Go ahead. Go ahead. Well, listen, playing. you got. I'm saying Play you got to embrace the shit though. Like Play you got to embrace it. Niggas like that's gonna turn forty, bro. They don't have exactly. That. You know what? I was gonna say that. I, I, that now that is a great conversation starter because that is a completely new chapter. And Doja, if, if if can I can we be transparent on here or can we be honest with everybody? Because yeah. like sleep, you you still married? Not you sleep. had girl dad. <laughs> And then you are recently divorced, yeah. right, Doja? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And you have the, and you're like a dad. You're a boy dad. You have custody yeah. of your kid. Right. Right. And so, how's that transition been? Let me, let me pull up again. This gets. Oh well, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Experience, man. Like you know, um, I mean, you can go so many ways with that. Me being a dad for Niall. Uh, I get a lot of, I get a lot of, you know, oh, you a dope dad, da, 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 da. but I'm just like, bro, I can't be a dad for you. Okay, like for example, uh, Aria, my goddaughter, Sleepy's beautiful uh, daughter, I can't be a perfect dad for her, right? Because she has one. And to anybody else's child, like that would be disrespectful for me to be like, yeah, I'm the best dad, da da da. da. Like I could be a good dad for for my son. Now I just happen to put my shit on Instagram because I think this shit is cool. Like not so much like. Likes like ooh look 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 look, but it's just like you know what I'm saying like this is a cool moment where my son is experiencing something, we're doing something. You know what I'm saying why not? So uh, that's where that came from as far as that. But as far as like, I just embrace you know what I'm saying the the culture of just being a dad. But truthfully, um, every day is something different. Like now it's three going on thirteen. Words tantrums, applesauce. Dude, we just on a whole nother whole another level so um yeah i mean post divorce uh just learning how to co-parent learning how to be present for all scenarios you feel me okay okay and i and think you're a dope dad man you do a good aw, job look at the brotherhood take no no my man has a hard time taking compliments like and we've been friends for over 20 years yeah just because someone says you're a good dad don't mean that you, we take it some away from ourselves. Right, we just, right. We just, we just see good traits and good things that you're doing for your son. Yeah. Yes. Right. And yes, dads you know. sometimes. Like moms, right. moms are fantastic and I'm not taking anything away from motherhood, but like you a single dad. That's yeah. not common. So no, take take your flowers, man. Like take them. You're a good father. Right. Yeah. Right. We know some trash okay. dads out in this world too. You're not one of them. You good? <laughs> Ooh. Look, I, I, okay. yeah. So I mean, it's just it's it's just embracing like who you are, and I think that we we say that a lot. That oh, you know, it's a lot of people that don't show up for their kids, and y'all niggas are showing up. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call y'all the N words, no, but I mean, a, but, I, but, I, 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 but, but like I said, like I'm, I, I'm you're okay. I, but, <laughs> so I'm, I, I'm trying not to, but I am. Um, don't but, let the degrees, don't let no degree of nothing trick you. I will do some nigger shit at times. Yeah, I'll be at work and these white people, I'll just be like, oh. Yeah, Anglos is stressful, but you know, Anglos, Anglos is stressful. No, it's so funny. People, okay, sidebar, people be like, what does that mean? I'm like, so y'all didn't take history class? Like, that was the origin. They like, call Anglo Saxons. Like, what yeah. do you mean? So, anyway, yeah, um, but no, like I said, like, I, I see, you know, both of you guys being hands on. I don't have no kids. I got a puppy and I have a nephew, son, and a niece. So, <laughs> Take your time. Uh, we both who are we're older than you. My daughter just turned six. I'm 40. So obviously yeah. I had my kid quite late. Uh yeah. How old is uh now now? Three. 
So yeah, we, we both waited till we could. I'm not like, pressed. Oh, I'm gonna tell you right now, what, I ain't pressed. What I ain't is pressed. The, what's the right time? Like, I, there, I, I just this is always. I don't been. think there's ever a right time. Well, to yeah, have a kid, like, when do you when do you like? There's the okay. This we gonna plan to have kids. I mean, you can plan to be like, yeah, because I want to be this age. Yeah, this age. But it's just like, yo, if that, it's gonna happen, how it's gonna happen. You know what I'm exactly. saying? Like, you don't really like. I feel like when you plan for something like that, you just you just you just plan for failure because. So many different things can happen. Health complications, God forbid, like yeah. financial situations, life be life in. So, like trying to go through a scenario in your head of being like, Yeah, have my kid by this time so it can be this age, and then we can it's just it's cool. a lot of times people uh, don't understand the concept of themselves. And so mm. a lot of people, when you don't have confidence or sense of security in who you are as a person and you live by uh, society's like standards of things, um, you push certain things to happen when they might not necessarily, like, so it's like inertia a little bit. Mm. So I, th I think that's right. Yeah. <laughs> so you're like yeah, forcing yeah. something to happen and instead of taking your time. And that's how a lot of people end up in a summer walker situation and a lot of times signs be right there a lot of people a lot of people ass album, by the way a great ass album yeah can't yeah. relate but baby that song <laughs> sizzle, i'll be like when they come on when they when them chords come out i'll be like uh, Hold on. Can't, not me though. Like, i can't relate to that but <laughs> I focus on album though. That's your album. Should, when Sizzle say, uh, swap the credit cards on me, I'm like, yeah, swap the credit cards on me. <laughs> I, 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 I have not listened to Summer Walker's album. I'm sure it's fantastic. Yeah. Nigga, please give us a favor. Well, well, at least, at least. I've been listening to Silk Sonic. I've been listening to Okay, Silk I did Sonic. listen to that yesterday. I did listen so, to it twice. I've been listening mm -hmm. to that. I'm going I'm to listen to Summer Walker eventually. No this yeah. to Summer though. She, oh, I'm gonna I, just tell you. I'm gonna tell you the, the 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 main songs you probably need to listen to. No love with SZA, constant bullshit, and the the joint with Ari. Ari, I saw, I saw the no love. Uh, the, she got a video for that. I saw the video for that. Oh mm -hmm. shit! I didn't even know there was a video. Yeah, yeah. I saw the video. Yeah, you know oh. Ari got a new album out too. Is it? Oh, I thought it was just a single. Nah, I think she got. I thought she had some more title. Unless I'm late to the party. Could well, I party. look. I don't know. I or early to the party if it's or, not. or you could be early. I think you. I think you early, but mm -hmm. but um, you end up in situations like that. A lot of people they see the preview, and instead of like clicking the channel, they want to go to the movies, mm -hmm. and so they create these crazy tumultuous movies, and it's just be like mm -hmm. shoulda, woulda, coulda. I don't want to be that shit. Like even yeah. if like I have a kid, let's say it doesn't work out with my partner. You know, like I wanted to be on some shit. Like, okay, we may might have grew out of love, or something happened like that, or. But I don't want to resent having a child by yeah. somebody. I don't yeah. want. I have too many people that are like that, and I'm like, well, this person really showed you who they were, and you mm. just didn't. You didn't care. Mm. I don't want to feel like that. Yeah, that's real. I mean, I think so, that I mean, um, when you think about life it? and relationships, just period. You can't go through with any decision that you make and resent it. Everything is a, a, a learning process. Yeah. It's a hundred percent a learning process. So you might make a mistake, you might fumble, you got to get back up and, and get back out there when you are emotionally ready to date again and try not to make those same mistakes again. I think a lot of times we get caught up in having a type. Like I like this kind of girl, I like this kind of yeah. guy. And that kind of guy keep doing you wrong, but that type yeah. of girl keeps doing you wrong. Thank God I don't have no type. You got to switch it up. Like, hey, switch it up a little bit. You like that? I got no type. Hey. I don't. I don't. I don't, like. I. I don't. But that, no. And that. But see, that that those are conversations that I've had with my homegirls. Well, and I'm like, well, hey, don't limit and, yourself. No. Yeah. I'm like, for what? I might miss out on my blessing dating a certain type of person, and so. I was explaining that to a homegirl, and I was just like, well, if you're saying this is what you only like, and you keep getting the same results, isn't that like narcissism and like people that are like sociopaths, kind of? That's I'm like that. If yeah, you I'm like. The same thing and expect a different result, like that's you. At that point, it becomes you. Like, yeah, no, no, absolutely. You're putting so, yourself in that bad situation again and again and again. 
I didn't, I didn't, I did not mute Doja this time. I, I, but I see his mouth moving. Oh, go ahead, talk, big dog. We can't hear oh, wow. you. We cannot hear you. Unmute yourself. Nope, can't hear you. Can't hear you. Go out but and come back in. You got to back out, back out, baby. Come back in. Okay, because I was like, I was like, I see his mouth moving, but I don't, I can't hear. Um, but and and so I was trying to explain to her. I'm like, I'm not judging. And again, like I, I, I only know what I know. But what I know is that you're telling me that you like a certain type of person, and it's not working out. So I just want you to do better. It's really hard sometimes to talk to friends about their love interests because yeah. when when, you, when their heart's involved in it, they don't want to hear it from you. Like they don't. Yeah, we, they don't. And, I, and I've been there. I think everybody has been there. When you think that person's the one, you put your blinders on and you ignore, yeah. you ignore a lot of the stuff that you see. And that does not mean that somebody has to be perfect because nobody is. But if there are certain red flags that you see early, you might want to, you know, at least pump your brakes. That doesn't mean stop dealing with them, but yeah. like address it with that person. Like, hey, you keep doing this, and I don't vibe with that. And if they continue to do that after you talk to them, it's them, and they got to go. Right. No, mm -hmm. that's absolutely true. Uh, what were you gonna say, Dozier? I was gonna say like, uh, there's a. I think what I've learned, right? There's a benefit in um in dating yourself. And when I say dating yourself, there's a benefit in like. Learning more about things that you like, that you don't like. I think, I forgot which one of y'all said people evolve. But nonetheless, like, as you move on in life, you realize certain things that were for you aren't for you anymore. So how you're changing, who you are. Like, having a, a mirror conversation. Like, my therapist taught me to have a mirror conversation. Like, because um, you only see yourself through cameras, you know, other people's eyes, and whatever. But so you be in the bathroom like Issa? Hey, listen, sometimes you know, you get, that, get that lyric out before you go to work. Be like, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. You feel me? Like, sometimes you got to have fun with it. But I'm just saying, like, you, you have to do work on yourself to know who you are. Because you can show up in front of a pretty face, whoever, whatever energy you're trying to entertain. And if you don't even know who you are, then how you go try to, you feel me? Like, it ain't going to work. It ain't going to work. Like said work. Keyword work. Relationships will work. You got relationships will work. Relationships with yourself. Everything is always work. A lot of people don't want to do the work. A lot of people like the drama. A lot of people like being a sad love song or whatever. And but it's always yeah, but, but whatever the whatever whatever the situation may be, it's always it's never any accountability. Some people like it there. That's weird mm -hmm. to me, but I don't mm -hmm. do I can I I exit people out like that. Because I I talk about this all the time. Like I, I had a, a friend that was my friend from preschool. And last year I ended that friendship because of that. I was like, it's the same shit every day. Damn. And the situation that crossed the line didn't really, it affected me indirectly because it had to do with my mom, but I was just like, hey, you know what? It's a no for me. That's it's good. been a while, you know, 30, almost 30 something years, but Damn. I'm cool. Damn, that's big. No, I mean, yeah. you, you, you have to do that though. Um, even with friendships, mm -hmm. if somebody, we, we all do evolve. They say yeah. every yeah. five to seven years, you know, we change, we grow. Mm -hmm. If you're still in the same yeah. place you were when, when we were, you know, 30, 25, I'm probably not going to hang out with you as much as I used to. Mm -hmm. It doesn't yeah. mean that I don't love you, that don't mean that, that, that we're not people no more. But, like, the stuff I was on when I was 25, I wouldn't think about doing now at 40. Like, you just got to move different. Like, you Nigga. Move different. Nigga. You got to move different. You, got, you, you, you have to. You I don't have drink to. vodka no more. Um, yeah, <laughs> I gave up vodka a long time ago. Okay, oh vodka. my god, I, I, oh no, no. I, I posted a picture of my story. I was like, uh uh, this is why I can't drink this shit. Mm -hmm. And like the vodka was like running, I was probably taking the last shot or double shot out the bottle, and it's like running off the side of my mouth. And I'm like, this is oh, why I don't no. drink this shit now. But college, yeah. college, 
But it, but that's true. I and I, I think, especially our 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 generation, we are we give people a certain amount of like grace because we all understand that people, everybody got their shit, and we all trying to figure it out. But yeah. within that grace, it's like okay, how often are we gonna continue to keep doing this? And mm-hmm. having this conversation over and over again about whatever, and I, oh, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't waste the time with people anymore. When you show me at this age, that's who you mm-hmm. are, and if it don't vibe with me, yeah, to the yeah. left. I think that's where it comes in. That's that's where the communication piece comes in, as far as tapping in with partner, friend, whoever you want to consider like giving your energy to. But like if you don't have those moments where you tap in with your person, whatever that person is to you in that moment, then you go always find the similar results because there's no talk about change. There's no talk about like what's going on in your life. There's no talk about like accountability, growth, none of that. It's just the same like surface situation and you can't be served with somebody you care about i can't we said with myself i can't be served with somebody i care about you got to be all in you know what i'm saying so um and that might be uh you said I'm, I'm a tourist so what that means hard-headed right so maybe that's a home <laughs> maybe that's maybe maybe that's a fall i don't know it's a gift and a curse but um with every relationship that i've been in friendship romantic whatever like i'm all in Right, it's, it's 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 about being vulnerable, being open. You know what I'm saying, and just putting yourself out there. Now, if you can't do that, for me, it's just like, okay, then who am I talking to? Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, yeah. So, I couldn't imagine um, having a date and start over again. Like, I just couldn't. It just seemed. <laughs> things seemed having a date and what start over again? Having I, a I date. Could, I couldn't imagine like if I was single tomorrow and having to start over. Woo! Like, Everything what? just seems so complicated now. I was like, it wasn't this hard when I was back in the day. But they y'all be going, it. y'all, y'all going through it. So you know, <laughs> stay strong because y'all going through it. <laughs> it uh, I mean, it's 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 we'll be like, do you guys home, bro? Okay, <laughs> hey, I love you, bro. We gonna put we gonna put already to bed. My wife want to see me. You, go ahead, you gotta leave. All right, all right, I, 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 I I just. I, I, I will say, it, I, I mean, it, it is, hard. It, I, I, I think um, I've never been like, I, I feel like I've probably been on dating apps in my 20s. I'm going to say like mid to late 20s, only lasted a tw- like 24 hours on them where they have been so swipe, black people meet, uh, what was it, OK Cupid and coffee meets baby or whatever it was but it was just like it this is not for me because i really crave i'm the type of person that i like thrive on interaction i don't i don't want to be messaging this person or swiping to see like oh i think he might be cute but then here are all these superficial statements and all of that. So I never really was really invested in that to begin with. So I would go to places where I felt like I might have a bigger chance of meeting people and, um, you know, stepping out of my comfort zone because I can't go to the same places and me think I'm going to meet somebody new this Mm -hmm. time. I have to venture out and my, um, my sister just moved back to St. Louis and is embarking upon that journey. And I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Oh, no, nope. Your sister's single again? <laughs> St. Louis in trouble, baby. St. Louis is in trouble. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know that. We don't that long. I don't know that person. Hey, man, listen. Respectfully, respectfully. respectfully. Her, her and her sister. I felt like you used to put boys in the blender here in St. Louis. Really? <laughs> hey. Janelle, do you hear this? Is she really? back right now? Now? No, she's Is not she... here right now. Oh, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, why do you think that we used to put people in the blender? Like I, I just don't know, but anyway. Really? It's <laughs> right. No, no. No, nigga, we here now. We here. Like, like, I just don't mean. know. I just don't you know. Can't say, you, we not going to glaze over that. <laughs> 
Okay, Explain. No, no. Because, uh, you got the floor. You got the floor. No, no. I don't know anything from personal, like anything. This is just from the outside looking in. So I don't know. So obviously I misread that. You know, you can't judge a book by its cover. So I, I made a mistake. Um. So what you hear? Because you heard I, something. I <laughs> <heard anything. laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> You know, hey, my mom no, taught me a, va a very valuable lesson in life. Um, and it was to believe half of what you see and none of what you hear. I agree. Listen, hey, I will say this. Both of y'all have always been super cool and super dope. So, hey. Come on, sleep. Come there on, you go. There you go. I just want to. Okay, so what? You, go. Okay, okay. You ain't got to talk about me. My what you heard about me? I ain't heard nothing about you, girl. Because I wasn't. I feel like I feel like if somebody thought something or was under. Yeah, but sleep. I was in St. Louis so briefly, and I think our relationship. When you really think about it, um, Daryl and I talked about this. Um, it seemed like I was probably Disney. closer to like. Y'all age range because Adrian then was getting me in the club and I was under yeah. age. Hey, time out. I didn't want to say that. I didn't yeah. Mean, I didn't, I, I didn't yeah, no, no, we talked that. about it. We talked about it. Because well, I was sitting here like, I know she's not talking about me being 40 when her ass was at the club with me. But, <laughs> you said that. You, you should have said that. I, I didn't want to put you out there because I was like, Yeah, no. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. We like, talked about you, this. Like, this ain't college parties that we talk about. You were at club clubs. So here's the thing, too. <laughs> I saw the best of both worlds in St. Louis. No, no. I, I got to hit the free time joints, them sagu joints, because I knew people. I'm all about connections, baby. <laughs> and then I was going to branch and college shit getting shot at. So hey. I got classy and I got ratchet. Hey, and that was a time. Man. Dope. So that's, why, Doja, that's why I was surprised when both of y'all was like, I don't. Like she don't know you and you don't know her. I'm like mm. we were at the same spaces. Yeah, other stuff. <laughs> miss bro. And, miss. Like, and you six twelve, dog. I'm like, how can you see your big ass? Like you tall as shit. Like she I don't understand. I, look, like, I was, you got to think like I was probably when I was at those parties. I was like with the people that I knew. So I mean, I would say like, what's up to you, Adrian, D, and. Then I would be with my friends from college because, like, everybody that I hung out with from Webster, you remember, they were older than me. Webster. So, yeah, Webster, <laughs> shout out to the Gorlocks. Good ass uh, school, Webster. Man. Hey, that was Webster yeah. had all the girls, bro. It was all at Webster. All of them. You said they was all at Webster? All the girls was at Webster, <laughs> dog. I mean, it was some at Washu too, but Webster? Yeah. If we call oh, Washu, hell, of, we call Washu like the land of milk and honey. Land of milk and honey. Like <laughs> really? Webster was like Webster was like the end of the rainbow. How you get it's supposed to be some gold there? That was Webster. They was there. No, I'm gonna take that. Right. I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna say that as because I was young then. They was up there, bro. Man, <laughs> and I'm gonna tell you, Webster crafted some lifelong relationships for me. Like all my my friends that I have now that I'm consistently in touch with like their family and we all met at Webster. I, I, I just realized how I met you, I think. I yeah, was, you met you met me in Shea office. Yeah, I met you at Shea office. I went up there uh just to to see Christopher Butler who was going up to Webster at that time. Oh yeah, yeah. that's right. And then, uh, the music thing. And Shay uh oh, an AKA, shout out to the case. So I stopped by to say what's up to uh to Shay and then that's how I met you. Damn. We would I would skip class in Shay office. Yeah, that's a damn Shay. <laughs> and and uh, here's the thing: what's a cost too much to be skipping class? Right. But some days you just it was just too much whiteness, and I dealt with that mm. from transitioning from city schools to high schools, with being in the DSEC program, and then going mm. to Webster. And I was like, man, this is damn. Where is yeah. So that was yeah. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. It was a lot of white. So you from St. Louis for real, for real. I thought Nigga, I'm from the West Side. Wait, you know so I grew up on Page and Goodfellow. I, I, okay. Yeah. So I, See, you know what? I'm now this you, is so I didn't know you before college. Right. So I thought you were a transplant. Like you, you know. I, well, one, you were at old people's shit. So I, I thought you just <laughs> came to St. Louis. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, you I'm knew St. Louis had a corporate job. 
She moves like, like, yeah, I'm really, I'm really from Chicago type shit. Yeah. No. Exactly. I'm like, because I've been around. I, I was on the scene for way too long. Well, I'll take that back. I did stuff in high school. Then I, I pledged, and then we kind of threw parties post graduation too. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I didn't see you anything to that at anything until that time. So I automatically assumed you from out of town. Like, no, no uh, but no, so you, how, just, you was just young as shit coming to our stuff. Yeah, yeah, I was. So uh, I'll though. tell you, I'll tell you how that even happened. Uh, so Adrian, about, before you go into that, is your sister around my age then? Yes. No. Okay. Well, she's three years older than me, so my sister is thirty-seven. So yeah, she yeah, so right. she's closer to that bracket. Well, what high school did you go to? I'm a D-Sag cool, uh, D-Sag kid too. I went to Lafayette out in Baldwin. Oh, okay, yes, yes. And then those are what high school you Central. Choose? Come on, man. Wh- which Jeez. central? BPA? Oh, okay. County boy. <laughs> oh my parkway central. County oh, boy, you feel me? She said which central? Hey, man, <laughs> the only central. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, no. Um <laughs> No, I yeah, I went to I went to Lindbergh and then I went to Parkway North. So oh, uh Okay. Yeah, so I then but I went to Gateway uh middle. You went to, you went to Gateway Middle? Yeah, I went to Gateway Middle. Oh, you um, went to for real. Okay. I'm, yeah, and yeah. so that's, that's how we uh my sister met Tahir and so she introduced us. And Tahir would lie oh, and tell yeah. y'all I sold him guns. I did not. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't believe that anyway. I wouldn't believe. You know what? Every pe- when people meet me and they really like, they'll like. Once I get really comfortable, they's like, "Yeah, she might have really sold him guns." And I'm like, "I, I did not." You, I thought you were from California, like you know, from the valley. Yeah, right. No, Somewhere. no. I uh. So no, I met no. Adrian. Can you sit? Uh, I said I met Adrian. Is that the I, yes, she's like. <laughs> Let me just sit up. We got to call Peter. Oh, call oh my Peter. God. Sit Get the dog girl. drunk out the camera. We don't want to see the drunk. Like, she just, she just, she just want to be like involved. Like, and I, it's, it's my fault because look at her. She's so needy. It's my fault. It's totally my fault. I let you her sleep with me. That's, that's a whole thing. That's a whole thing. Yeah, I let that's, her that's, sleep that's with me. I was at, at the crib. The hell's what he'll be doing right now. Yeah, like. I'm like, girl, I'm about to put her on the balcony right here. And I'm trying to be nice, but whatever. So, well, I worked at Baker's at the Galleria. Shaga Adrian's Lee. sister, right? Mm. So keep the Galleria it's, safe, because I've been shooting anymore. up there now. Woo! Uh, <laughs> Bro, uh, which is also, I would see you all the time, because yeah. you worked in shoes at Famous I Bar. I shoes, too. Yep. Right. Famous uh, Bar. Oh shit! <laughs> well, come on. I worked at Lord and Taylor, and then Famous bought us, and then they turned it to Macy's. So, I oh, okay, okay, okay. Listen, I wasn't sure. Like, I was... So much, so much cologne out of Lord and Taylor. Like, yo, shout out to everybody who got cologne for me because it was real. Like, once Sleepy told me how, taught me how the game go. Don't look like that. You did it too. You did it too. You were stealing. You Don't do it. Come no, on. Was was you was definitely stealing. Stealing. Oh, listen, you know. listen. We have, Whoa. we have like, we had like whole it's outfits. What we doing? Like, it's what we doing. I'm doing. saying. Uh, I don't know nothing about stealing. Doing. Okay, I'm gonna tell you, I ain't never stole from my jobs ever, oh, and okay. I've been working in retail forever. Tell but also, like, I sold shoes. So, oh shit, it, it's like hard to sit, like, to steal shoes. That was it. I, I, I worked in women's shoes. I was I still in the women's shoes because you, you came upstairs and you got the cologne from behind the counter because you had that little key. Cause don't, don't, don't do that. I did. No, you no, told no. me how to do no, it. You, you never locked. You never locked it. So wait, I just, wait, wait. I just, you know, what I'm saying, Aldoja. 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 You got me confused. You have me confused with Antoine. I didn't work no. alone. <laughs> that definitely. I worked his shoes. That definitely. No, I come upstairs. You was downstairs, and Lord Taylor stopped playing, bro. I was, I was in down the shoe department. I was on the first. I was on the I was on the men's floor. And then you hit that escalator. What was he downstairs or upstairs? He was upstairs. You hit the escalator. You'd be like, all right, bro, I'm going to holler at you. I'm like, what you going to do? Don't worry about what I'm doing. I'm like, all How right. How would I get the key to come home, Doja? It's you. Oh, man. Hey, man. What are you talking Cause, about? Because you, you were slaying it, bro. It's all good. Listen, I was doing it, too. Why so how was y'all still in Cologne? Wait a second. Hey, listen, man, so y'all was just know. like, like what? What? Because so they, did they not do bad checks when you left? No, this uh, really was no. We, we walked through the back door. They ain't care. Aldoza, like, right, I'm using uh, a government name. Aldoza Thomas Bridgman. 
<laughs> you put the building in there? Oh no, shit! Time out. No, seriously, I'm gonna say you. I'm, I'm being for real. Did did I get cologne? What did I like? Did I get it? Yes. Did I work in cologne and steal it? No. No, no, no. You didn't work in cologne. I'm sorry. You oh, didn't work in cologne. Okay, baby, you were in apartment. Okay, did... But you definitely came. But you definitely came upstairs because I learned the game from you, and I was like, oh, bet that's how you do it. I said, oh. you know what? what? Okay. You wanna know how to do it? You wanna know how to do it? This is what you do. Don't you. So Don't listen, you. listen. This okay. Well, you didn't do it then. This is how okay, you, you didn't do it. So what was done, right? You know what I'm saying? When they come and do the little stock checks, whatever, 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 you tell them, okay, I got you. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in and I'll lock it. You just don't lock it. So you just stack whatever you go take. You put you know what I'm saying, make sure that every part has its own thing, and you just kind of just you are really giving sleep a headache right now. No, no, no. Okay. He's no. like, you no. looking like hey. Travis Scott sleep. No, no. Listen. He's exactly right. <laughs> Ooh. I, I, I think oh, you I think right here. Lost. Okay. So, yes. There was a person working in Cologne. His name is would, Antonio because you said it. That would leave that would leave the thing a lot. So, he's yeah. right about that. Yeah. He's 100% right. Yeah. I didn't have a key to unlock it because I worked in shoes. But Let was it unlocked? Yes, it was unlocked. He's, he's so, so did you take a bottle because it was unlocked? Jean Paul oh, Gaudier, Jean Paul Gaudier, whatever it's called. Yeah, that that no, the thing yeah. they had the man thing. Yeah, yeah. Come on now, talk. I that most, stuff. I most definitely. I, I don't know the statute of limitations on that. I don't know, but I most definitely, when I was like twenty two. I definitely was a cologne peddler. Yes. Oh I, yeah, I mean, hilarious. I, I was I was too afraid to steal and being black. So I just I just knew things was different for us. So I had no. Now I will tell you one time when I worked at the Grove out here in LA. So I transferred to Nordstrom out here. Okay. When we would have the designer sale, we um we would try to like stash like Hmm. the stuff because we knew like either it would be it was like the lowest level of it and they a lot of times they would send us to south coast plaza or to topanga canyon to the north Mm -hmm. out there so it would go to another markdown after it left our location so we had a fancy though it listen it was so i am still it was it, it was shoes so there were a couple of pair that I was gonna get. It was a pair of Prada sneakers for myself and a pair of uh Yves Saint Laurent, uh the tribute sandals, and it was this bomb ass, like bronze color. And every we had a spot. Somebody discovered the spot. Nigga, we got called into HR. Oh shit. and what oh. you do, listen, my, my mom being an attorney. Me taking public speaking, speech and debate, deny, deny, deny. All I said was, I was like, uh, I don't, I was like, I don't know about this stack of things. Uh, I had some sneakers that I did put aside for myself, but I bought them. And you can check my purchase history. I have purchased these sneakers. So I don't know about anything else or what anybody else has going on that has nothing to do with and they was like, so you didn't come? Nope. I don't know what you're talking about. Wow. I have no idea. I didn't lose my job. Wow. Shout out to the great DTJ. He knows Listen, me. seriously. Oh, yo, lie. Yeah, yeah, listen. Oh, yeah, you don't. Because I'm like, because what's <laughs> the point? I'm like, you, you don't have me on camera. And even if you have me on camera, I'm like, I don't know who that is. You don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. There's so many black people. We all look alike. Remember? That could be that could be what? Tasha. That could be Bro, Brandon. That's not me. Is. They're like, yo, we got you on camera. We have you on camera. That ain't me. This ain't you with the same with the same hair. But they the legal, same like glasses. they don't, but they don't wa- have cameras in those stock rooms. Like they can't watch you like that. Oh, she pulled it. She pulled But that's why they do bag checks and things like that when you leave. Mm-hmm. Oh like so they God. yeah because yeah. like sleep in the stock room at macy's y'all didn't have a camera no we didn't we did yeah we didn't. i'm like and i feel like even when i worked in cosmetics out here i don't think our stock room had a camera which is horrible because there should be a camera there like so. well i think they they probably <laughs> sold it they go based on the honor system bag checks and uh things like that but you could be per- having somebody buy something people would just steal all the time like customers so they was right. just like Shit. Man, bag dude, bag dude was like, yo, 
give me some polo cologne. I was like, let's bro, we good. As long, as long as I know where to play, we straight, bro. Walk out, you know what I'm saying? Sleep, you, you need a ride to crib? Yeah, I can roll with you. Cool, you know what I'm saying? Hey, what's hey, up, man. What's good? Hey, here you go, my dog. Yeah, holla. Yeah, all right, yeah. No, you're right. The bad guard definitely used to. He was cool. He was like, just give me. So y'all was just stealing, bro. What you mean? Why you say it like that? You said. Um, like, I yeah. am. I'm just. It wasn't no East Saint Laurent or no no. Big, it was small shit. I like, wasn't gonna steal the. Sh I was. Okay. I I was going to buy the Saint, the East Saint Laurent because I knew they was they, about to get marked down to two fifty. So I'm like, this is a thousand dollar shoe. I'm gonna get for two fifty. Oh, you damn right! I'm gonna stash it aside to the lowest markdown price. So this is before me. This is like top. This is before me and Doja had real jobs, like real. Yeah, money this is yeah. Money. This is before yeah, like, yeah, yeah. This is when the ribs was touching, like hamburger helper, no burger type situations. Like this was like because no, retail no. they wasn't paying that much. Shoot, they don't pay that no. much now. So no. they, I know they wasn't paying that much back then. And hey, I had to make had to make ends meet. So yeah. Come on, eighty dollars in the store. Yeah, amazing. Hustle sleep with, hey, hustle sleep was a different sleep, boy. I give it to you. Listen, you was hustling. Uh, clean. Oh, and you know what? Yeah, and I'll tell you now me. that, like, the way to even get paid, like, if you had to work at those companies again, would be to work for a fully leased department. Mm -hmm. And where Macy's didn't contribute any money to your pay or anything, and my company when i worked at macy's it was partially leased. so macy's pay a certain like pay half of my salary and my benefit paid the other half okay and i dope. got so they so i got shortchanged on my hourly mind you i was a manager mm. because of this bitch and i still man <laughs> it'd be some people it'd be some people like and we wrong but i was just yeah. like don't let me ever see that bitch and it was in the time I saw her after I had quit, because I was like, not, oh, I was never, I was never, oh, God humbled me real quick. Yeah. Like when I lost my job at Saks and I had to work at Macy's, that was a very humbling experience. And I was the just West like, Side just came out. She said, man, hey, y'all don't feel like, well, she's like, well, I see that beast. No, but I'm going to tell you right now, I was like, oh, and I'm like, I hate this chick, Karen. And she was like a her name, was, her name was Karen. Her, her, no, but she wasn't a Karen. She was like from uh, uh, Colombia or El Salvador or something. So she was like, um, she was just terrible. And everybody hated her. And she like had been working with these people for all these years. And some shit went down with the new uh like security, like the head of like LP. Mm -hmm. She didn't have none of those people back. So my homegirl uninvited her from her wedding. And wow. so, yeah, so I was just like, okay, cool. I ain't got to deal with her. And so then I go to the wedding. She there. I was like, what the fuck happened? Why is she here? And I was like, and she lucky this is your fucking wedding because you go like this. <laughs> some people just need to get banged on, okay? Yeah, that's that oh. website right there. That's that page right there. That's that page. Some people right do. There. And it's just like, because nobody has ever checked them and you've always been in this position of power over people. Mm -hmm. But it was one day I was real petty when they was talking about um I think Trump they was going to like reverse or suspend like the dream act so it was going to like fuck shit up for like a lot of people that had like came over here for um what not uh, I can't think of the word and but whatever they it was, they received their visas yet, but they were over here for educational purposes or whatever, or, or like, working. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it or you had came here on as a under, child. And your yeah, as a child. Reason. Yes. So that's kind of what she was here for, and I was like, oh, so does that mean you're gonna get deported? Come out, you ask for that. Damn. Yeah. Hey, you problematic. That's you can't do that. I'm not problematic. <laughs> she knew, she could say shit because she knew she was a bitch. You see how she, ooh, that's the page right there. No, I want to, you said, she gonna say she's so big. You see how she went and took her cup and she was like, My apologies. She let, she let that bitch sorry, sorry. right there. Anyway, I, this is not even she was a big. How do we get I didn't even want to talk about it. It just, it just, this, it took a turn on its yo, own. I this have points. Like you said that this bitch real, 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 real strong. I just want to say that. Hey, like, no, no, hey, hey, a, bitch. a moment, of, be serious for a second. We didn't talk about, Nothing for real, but it was great catching up. I've had a fucking blast. Like I ain't gonna front. Like it, it really, it was really a catch up because I was like, oh, I was gonna talk about the 
how people try to like date and since we were we were about to get there and then it said way because i was like oh you know you being back you know new to dating well this is the dm you sent so why did you think that it was okay to say this and you said Whoa. that i was stressful <laughs> and all <laughs> <laughs> oh wait. So I was just talking about like how people shoot they shot. Like I want to talk about like dating relationships and things like that and like <laughs> I see. We didn't even get there. We didn't hey, get man. there. Hey man, listen. Nigga said that we could have been married with a kid in AAU basketball right now, but you playing. And I was like, nigga, you just was married and you had a kid. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm so this, happy. This, this, this it, ain't got to do with me. I'm going to be like, no, 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 no. It came, up, it came up. It came yo. up on. It, it is posted on the IG. It is there. I'm gonna just put this. I'm gonna. Can I mute my? No, this? don't mute yourself because we're talking. No, 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 no. <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm gonna be. Listen. I'm gonna be. Me and Doja used to always um, when we would go out. Sometimes Doja is like six eight. You know, he's super tall, six twelve. So he would be an athlete, and not be his agent. I'm gonna be his agent right <laughs> now. All right, so listen. He didn't know you personally, but through social media, he felt like he'd gotten to know you, and he thought that if y'all would make that connection, you would have been a good candidate for someone that he would like to date. And if y'all would have did it earlier, y'all might have had a kid in AAU right about now. So he was just talking about his fantasies and dreams and seeing if they align with yours. That's what he was doing. Or well, also, it was, yeah, just doing so much. Definitely, uh, definitely. definitely what? Yeah, yeah I got definitely. You. I like, no, 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 no. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Cool. Look, he thought that y'all. I'm just saying. Definitely, uh, <laughs> definitely was like, yeah, that was me. I apologize. You know, what I'm saying I was doing too much, playing too much, but uh, you know, was, hey, I, I learned from my mistakes. Um, or listen. you could be used to talking to a certain type of chick that think saying things about, oh, we could have had a kid. <laughs> That's okay. a, no shade. Some bitches get off on that. I just was like, what? Probably so. And see, and here's the thing. Like now we're we're developing a friendship. I think you hella cool. Yeah. Like you know, I I love love you. <laughs> but that's all I'm saying. So what are the right things? Like what should you say or what should? Oh my God, can we do for the love of Doja? Like as well, love Doja? The, no. Yeah, no, like do the last And I'm like, we no. Did it, we did this on our last show. We not for no, 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 heck no. So no, I can no, interview Doja. people to date you. No, that's Heck always no. been my dream is to like Yo. meet people for my friends to see if they worthy of their time or not. <laughs> what is I'm, going I'm, on? I'll be, I'll be a I'll be a assistant director to the show and give you some feedback on what she should do. There we go. Uh, this ain't yeah. fun. Nah, hell no. This took um, a turn. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, listen, um, Aldoja. Yeah. yeah, I'm securing myself. You're an attractive young man, Miss Soward. I don't know if I don't know if you want your government on here, but Miss Soward. Nigga, they know they know my they know me. Uh, oh, okay, well you're they an attractive know you. young lady. Ooh. All those you was trying to do was spark conversation, and it looks. I like know, it worked. I know, it was funny because to me. Now y'all have become closer and, and are friends, and 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 yeah, and he learned from his mistake, and there you go. <laughs> yeah, learn from my mistakes. Yes, yes. She put me on blast on the show, boy. I didn't put you well, I put you on blast on Instagram, so I really was just spinning the block on the conversation no, right. about maybe how because you because it, it's interesting just because even you sleep set, I wouldn't want to be out there. It seems treacherous. Yeah, no, no, so, it seems stressful. It just seemed real stressful. Because you know what? Because this, I would have never had to deal with this back when I was single and dating. I screenshot and this, I would never have to like. It's so much strength. No, 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 no. I asked him was it okay? I asked him was it okay? I did. I did ask. I did ask permission. Oh no, she was like, was it okay? Yeah. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. I just. I've been out the game for a long time, so this, like, this dynamic of, even if I saw you on social media, 
I can't necessarily be my authentic self because one, you don't know me, so you don't right. know if I'm joking. But two, I could be in y'all group chat or I could be on your IG and I'm just being me. I'm goofy. That's that's my jokes, but you don't know how I joke. Mm. Like it would be so much stress to like, how do I approach her? How does that like whereas in real back in my day, you just walk up to a chick and just talk to her. Yeah. And if it bomb, it bomb. But it wasn't recorded yeah. and I ain't got the word like I, yeah, it's woo. And and I know it's hard for y'all too, because niggas be lying and all the shit that go with that. Like yeah. I understand. Man. It's just stressful, period. I we ain't gonna talk, talk, talk about that. We ain't gonna talk about the comment section. I'm gonna leave the long leave the longs on the day, y'all. I mean, since I mean it, people don't have it. So I mean in <laughs> oh screenshots. Lord. I, I just but also because because sometimes it's some shit like you can't make up. But we also, yeah. we are all educated people True. on this platform right now. And so it's True. certain True. things that we also know how to decipher real from fake, like the reality. <laughs> so we understand that as you pour another drink, uh, Ooh, I'm the like, idea and the I ain't, drink, I ain't drink this whole show. I'm good. I'm good. I had, I had an Irish coffee. Listen, listen. It's all whiskey crazy. sour. So I, I know like I had an Irish coffee because I was like, I don't need some coffee in for this. Um, <laughs> but, but, but no, uh, like I am so happy that you can't go back and find like an old Facebook nothing and be like sleepy. And, and, <laughs> you know, no, 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 no. You want to know what's crazy is is true. It's just that being somebody that is building a a platform where you are in front of people. You yeah. think about like certain things that you say now or how mm-hmm. to respond to certain things because everybody can take shit out of context. Mm-hmm. Or you say stuff solely for entertainment purposes and people take it seriously. Mm-hmm. Man. Like, My like I got people. proposition like the other day, somebody in, in the request. And yeah, it was what? somebody prop- like this guy was pretty much like, hey, like I'm hella down. I watched the episode of uh, you on Zoom with the homies. And I will let you peg me. And I was like, Wait, whoa, whoa, I was like, whoa, okay. whoa, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, 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 I will, wait, I will wait, read wait, the wait. message. I will read the exact no. <laughs> But I was just so confused. Cause oh, I was like, so wait, wait, wait. Come on, wait, wait. Oh, this goes what into, this goes into the reality of He like, said, hi there, I'm Joel. Hope you, uh, hope your day went. Wait, you just said it. <laughs> the nigga said it in here. So, uh, anyway, he was just like, uh, I'm just shooting my shot. Close mouths, don't get fed. I appreciate that. He's like, but I've watched you since Zooming with the homies and other appearances on YouTube and all of the, uh, and on all Dev Digital. And I got a crush from a distance. In short, I'm a submissive pansexual and gender fluid male. I don't know if you're into guys like that, but I'm very into pegging and I hear and seeing you are too. LOL, times like this, you could talk about pegging. I would love to get a chance to get to know you better. And so, so we so, can be real comfortable. Yeah. When did they start pegging on the west side? What is going on? <laughs> Nigga, I'm okay. dumb. I took that BDSM quiz. I'm like, ain't nothing about me submissive. All of that. Like, nothing about I me vanilla. But yeah. oh, you know what? Okay, let me be serious for a second. Put on my serious uh, face. <laughs> There's absolutely nothing wrong with liking what you like. Um, Joel, if you see this, bro. If that's what you like, that's what you like. You don't. You can't jump off the bridge like that with a message. You gotta just post the podcast, Joel. You can't just jump off the bridge and send that message until you build a rapport with somebody. With any type of thing sexual, you must build a rapport. Yeah. Before you just put that out there, like it, no matter what it was, pegging. Oh I want to be spanked. I want to dress in a bunny suit. Whatever y'all, whatever you like. Wait, wait. You, you can't just jump off the bridge, bro. I hope you see this, cause I'm with. Hey, listen, like what you like, and she cute. I understand why you you, you did it, but you can't do that. Honestly. It's the me, me too harassment. Like you can't yeah, just man. dive off the, the cliff like that. So, bro, find you a woman that's into what you into, and I hope that you live your fantasies, big dog. It ain't for me. But if it's for you, if you like it, nigga, I love it. Or you might not be a nigga, but fella, I love it. 
Because he definitely ain't a nigga. <laughs> I had a Listen, man, I had a you, 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 oh, um, <laughs> we have grown so much. You have to, no, 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 no. You, 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 you gotta, you, you have, you, you, uh, you he gotta be able, to, right? Huh? Your message ain't, your message not bad at all. That message right there. No, 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 but you you need you need to be able to stand on what the fuck you said. So like if you if 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 you say something and you you can't beat me, I can't be the person to deem it being a disrespectful, right? I can't you 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 can't tell somebody, yeah, well, I didn't mean for it to be disrespectful. Well, you, you, you still said it though. You see what I'm saying? So like once words leave your mouth or your phone or your text thread, whatever the fuck, like that's that's what it's gonna be. Right? So whoever take it is gonna be how they take it. Now, as far as how you learn from it, that's where the work come from. But I mean, he, my my man's went right to it. So again, I mean, you know, he felt comfortable enough to say it, and I, I can't speak for another. I wasn't movie. honestly. I wasn't offended. I didn't. Okay. I wasn't thinking right, cool. about it. It was uh, like, and I and that's just being clear. That's good. Uh, that's good. I I was not offended by what he said to me. I was just like, oh, like I think I would have probably responded. Had I been like a, like I thought he was like attractive for me, and I, I okay so so he he just wasn't he man, wasn't my and and that's not that's not everybody ugly, because he even in the, I didn't call him ugly I yeah. think he's a nice looking guy but he like I, okay so I'm gonna let y'all in oh exactly. man <laughs> I, 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 so I if that were hey. <laughs> You know what? I, ju I judge you for a second. I'm wrong for that. It's okay to like what you like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, because I was very judgmental for a minute. I judged you. I judged him. Yeah, we in a me, good place right now where you gotta let people love yeah, you. Yeah, you know. Let, and, do what you so, do. Huh, I mean, Google that. Let me Google that. Shit. Uh, bro, you know what it means. It don't mean you, that that that, that I won't. <laughs> so, and and and. and I took that I would if I, I were to I would that, quiz, that yeah that so it would be a guy that's like more along the Whoa. lines of what would be like masculine not, not more femme for me yeah 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 so if oh. I were to like do that so I would you want to, to dominate you trying to peg like a nigga that's like YG yeah oh my god <laughs> <laughs> That's just, I don't have, like, it would just be, yeah. You want yeah, a face it wouldn't. You need to have like a face tag and like did some time. Like, he got to be. But you have, but you, but, but you guys also think about it. You being cis hetero black males. Yeah. The idea of that, you feel like you are being somewhat emasculated, but it's not sex. It's just sex is fluid. Like, yeah. If you are dealing with somebody that is, um, this is a different it, time, man. This it's is, different. It is. It's, it's a different time where people are exploring their bodies more and doing all kind of stuff that you probably wouldn't. It's not, I, I think I'm just too old. Like, I, I just don't. Like, that kind yeah. of stuff, I don't even want to try. Yeah. Because yeah. I, 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 I've never thought to try it. So, like, yeah, it, it, it seems so foreign. But I have to put myself in a headspace to be like, yo, if you tried it and you liked it, who am I to judge you? I yeah. think that the, the world's way too judgmental. So, like again, Joel, my dog, <laughs> find you the woman that, that's going to take care of that for you, brother. Yeah. And so, man. so like, but I see that. Just leave it alone. Just leave it. I, 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 I got to understand. Yeah. No, it's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. And that's. I mean, and that's respectful. I just. I. I it's just. It's just <laughs> So many questions. <laughs> no, yeah. I, listen. You know what? At least once in my life, not all the time. It's just like, just oh, like oh, you wait, might so have. You, so you peg somebody, and you peg somebody before. Wait, can I ask that? I'm sorry. Hold on. What? You can ask that. Have you have you pegged somebody? Before? I, I was very close, but I mm -hmm. it didn't happen. What made you? Was, you do? was that? Was it because get, of the or was that? it more like? Was it? Was it? We could talk about it all. I, we could. You know what? It was a guy I was dating at one point. 
My man said, "Well, that I didn't even keep you, girl. I'ma do it." That's what happened. Yeah, well, but you have to also think. Okay, so look, I I like dating old niggas, like old older men, and like like sixty. Yeah. Come on, wait. You dated a sixty year old man before? Yeah. I learned stuff to do today. Yeah, you, I'm hey, like you, 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 you might be a yeah. You, hey, you are. We need you to get you. You're like an onion. That just how does that like? What 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 isn't that what's fun about me? Like I'm like being an Aquarius. Oh, is so great. Hey, no, nigga, you, hey, nigga, she <laughs> want an old nigga that want to get paid. You're not gonna get that, bro. <laughs> I, I, no, I, I, I don't. <laughs> Hold on, it, yeah. this went, wait, wait, wait. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm just trying to, I'm trying to, so, so like, was it, like, was, was he, he was, was, it, was the move just too much? Was the, was it like, what, what changed it from being? Why like, you want to know what the move was? Like, uh, I didn't have, I, no, didn't have I, just, strap. I didn't have a strap. That's how it almost uh, happened. I didn't have it. I didn't have a strap with me. Dog, oh, she yeah. got me. She yeah, like, but he let me put my fingers up there. That was interesting. But you have to, okay, so I'll tell you this. I'll tell you this. I think sometimes with older men, <laughs> you have to also <laughs> think that. Like, it's like, wait, like we in grade school. I got a question. <laughs> no, I don't have, have a question. You I'm have just... to think, like, men, like, oh, people shit. were starting to, I tell everybody this, and I feel like, well, you, you can't do this, Lee. Uh, but like, I always say, people should experience sleeping with somebody probably that's fifteen to twenty years older than them, because it is a different experience, and you do learn so much. And a lot of times, like those people, you would they really pay attention Ooh. and pick up on what your body is doing, so they fucking you on a whole nother level. So no, and, no, no. I can't do that. I can't. I can't do that now. But yeah, yeah. I just want to say you can't do that. No, no. I mean, I slept. I mean, I, saw, I lost my virginity when I was fifteen. So I slept with older women before. So I, wait, when you lost your virginity when you was fifteen, how old was yeah. that person? She was nineteen. But okay, so I, that's different. No, no, no. But I'm saying I've had sex with like. And also, that's still weird to me. Like, like but like I'm not was, judging. No judgment. Like I was a freshman in college. <laughs> no judgment. Like, no judgment. So I was a freshman in college messing with like a 29 year old. So okay, okay. And, and so when yeah, I like, when I was 25, I messed with like a 40 year old. So like, so I, yeah. I, I, so so think about what you gained. Yeah. So think about <laughs> what you have taken away from that experience that has helped elevate your sex game. I mean, throughout. Shit. But pegging never came up. How did that come up? Like, I don't understand. I mean, maybe just give it time. Like, you gotta understand. You know, too, oh, okay, oh, if, oh, I, if I had sex with somebody that is it's a different time, almost right. that's 25 years older than me. And they was like, little, I want to try something new. He woke up, like, you know what? No, it was like talking Shoot. about kinks and things about <laughs> oh, what you wanted to do. Okay. And so it came up in conversation. No, hey, you, listen. One, I got too much of this new mindset, but I mean that's I, I, sex I think, is fluid. No, she said yeah. sexuality is fluid. Yeah, I think that's the standpoint. And and, and, and and that's just what it is. Yeah. So yeah. I, think, I think I think the stamp I think the stamp is like it goes back to just like that communication piece, like and probably so. Like I, I'm imagining like talking to someone older, <laughs> talking to someone older. Like it's kind of like I don't got shit to lose. Like. Mm -hmm. I'm older now, I don't really give a fuck. Like it's kind of like if I'm sixty, like Lord willing, I see you, sixty years old. Yeah, and you you coming off the the heels of like kind of the end of like the sexual revolution, like that deep throat era, mm -hmm. and people really getting like super comfortable and mm -hmm. being open and honest about it. That's what I'm saying. Like it's not consistently, but I'm saying like at least I've learned. Yeah, yeah, but like but think, but, but think about it is that's that's the difference. So like. Somebody that's 60, right, in, in 2021, going in 2022. It's going to be 2022. That's fucking crazy. But anyways, somebody somebody who is 60 now that's that's experiencing this sexual revolution, revolution, right? Enlightenment. The, yeah, the new wave now is like that's happening right now. So like the 30 to 40 year old or shit, even as young as I guess 20, however young, you know, whatever, but like People are starting to be open to experiencing new things and like having those conversations about what you're comfortable with, what you're not comfortable with. 
And for some, that being an actual barrier for relationships, like if 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 somebody in the toe sucking and you're not in the toe sucking and you're not go like it's just okay, well this ain't gonna work. You know what I'm saying? Because I need that for my sexual like release. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So like those conversations are the conversations. I can have my toes suck. It don't do nothing for me. I mean, I'm, well, I'm just saying. Okay. I, I didn't want to say pig. I just wanted to say like. I was just being up. funny. Just, <laughs> just, 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 I know. I was being funny. You sharing too much. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Hey, man. Show, you think somebody's 60. Who I know that's 60? Doc. Your dad. I be liking daddies. You know, you know what? Hey, you, no, you like, no, no you bullshit. Like I'm saying right now. If you, you like met my daddy. dad, he'd definitely be like, hey, how you doing? How you doing? I'm like, hey, send me a picture of your daddy. Because I'm going to run up them bands and I'm going to ball till I fall. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> no, I'm for real. It'd be so funny because you, dog. I'm, I'm just being. I'm being good again. We are having a great time. Yo, have we are having had, a conversation. Have you, had, have you ever talked to somebody, one of your friends' dads before? That should be a quick answer. She no, 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 no. I'm trying to think about <laughs> who, who's daddy. Yes. Yo, that should be a quick answer. I just did the whole oh, thing. That should be a quick answer. <laughs> No, no, I'm, I'm, and I'm, and I'm trying to think even from St. Louis to now, because oh I'm like, you know, God. niggas don't be knowing their daddy, so I had to. Oh like, my niggas God. don't, niggas don't be knowing their daddy. daddy. So I don't know. Don't be doing it. Oh yo, man, yo, yo, <laughs> niggas don't be knowing their daddy, bro. This is the best. Yo, okay, come on. A, bring to a cookout. I'm on to something, right? Sleep. I'm on to something. I oh my that. goodness, yo, what would that be? You walk into a cookout with your boot with your old boo thing, and he look over across the room. You like that's a motherfucking father. Oh shit! Oh, hey, hey bro, oh, y'all know bro. each other. Okay, cool. that happened on that happened on a movie back in the day. Two could play that game. Yeah, bro, that's, that's crazy. That's, my movie. that's crazy. So okay, that's um, crazy. I will tell you this: a, a father son duo did try to tag team me, like to see who would get my number. Yeah. Out oh, okay. here at a comedy yeah. show. No, no, no. I, I thought that was about to go left. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, 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 no. They like one, the dad tried to get me in the club. And then I'm trying to think if I thought I that was I, going somewhere else. No, 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 not ta not tag team me like that, like a porno. Sorry, wrong, wrong, wrong. I word. was like, wait uh, a minute. But the 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 dad tried to talk to me in the club, oh, God. and I don't think and I don't think they knew that I peeped. But then the son stopped me outside the club, and okay. then asked for my number. And then I was like, uh, but I saw the dad off into the distance, Damn. and so I was like. <sighs> oh wow! So I low really did want the dad, but it was too much going on, and then I ended up giving the son my number, and then the son left me y'all this long like voicemail, and you, you I was like, like, "You doing too much?" I am, I am and not shot. enough at the same time. So I never it? hit What's, him back. I got to raise my hand. I got to say something real quick. What? So um. I have guested on a few podcasts, and me and Doja, we have our own. And yes. This is the most interesting conversation I've ever had. <laughs> like, I don't know what to say right now. Uh, <laughs> See, he's like, whoa, whoa. I am on, listen, I'm telling y'all, yeah. I will give come back anytime. A year this is, this is on this, is this shit. shit. Give me a this year, a year and a half to really go ham. This shit gonna be live. California oh. different. Y'all just living real different out but there. Is it? But is it California? Or is it just me? It's Cal. It might be. Hey, you. It might because like no. I, I'm it's telling you. you, it was when I worked at Baker's. I wanted to fuck those the VP of Baker's so bad, and he was like this older white guy. He was just so <laughs> fine to me, and Joe, rest in peace. He was like, he was flirty and everything. I would get shoes for free. <laughs> I'm here in Baker's Marketing, all of that. I, and we never did nothing. But he was just a really nice guy. He was just oh. a really nice guy. <laughs> 
So I always had a thing. I don't have daddy issues. I know I like I don't like my dad. Now we hella cool. I actually didn't nigga home yesterday. I gotta come back. But that was but I don't. I'm. I, I. It's not like oh, I'm looking for something to replace something that's missing. Cause what the hell do? That was what I tell you. They got niggas in the blender, bro. Her blender is different than what I thought it was, but it's still a blender. That mother <laughs> that mug on frappe. <laughs> really? So now oh. y'all think I'm some sort of man eater, huh? Nah, but 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 but, but like, let me let me just let me just dialogue with you though. Like, even, but but even if you were though, like, and I'm not. I, you got to live your truth. Live your, live your truth. But even if you were, yeah, like you, you find more transparency in, in who you are versus who you, who you aren't. However that, however that correlates. You know what I'm saying? So I mean, yeah, shit. If you, if you, if you out, hey, listen. If, if that VP is is giving you that proper play to make that thing happen and shit, I guess you, you know, tag it to the list. Yo, I get. Have you ever had sex with a? VP of a company? Yeah, I actually have. Oh shit! Okay, all right, cool. Oh my god! It's a it, 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 it heavenly smile. He's like, yeah, oh. yeah, I, I did. I, no, yeah. but you know what? Okay. Have you? No, wait, wait. Wait. Ask ever, the question. Go ahead, sleep. Go ahead, sleep. Have you ever had somebody put in like a box? Like you think you know somebody, and you got them kind of like in a box, and then they like shatter all that. That just happened today. Like the box I had you in, gone. Like you, you are a whole Ooh. grown ass person now that I thought I knew that I do not obviously know, but I should not know you in that way, which, which is why this is even extra weird. I'm like, oh my god! But you have to also remember that blender. You only saw like <laughs> there's no blender. <laughs> blender. It's just that like you you saw like a certain you saw how I like presented myself back home. This is this is crazy. I didn't see that. I only saw this. So I mean, this is this. I mean, this. I this mean, is all you know. <laughs> no, I'm saying no, 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 no. And I'm not saying it's a bad thing. It's just like, yo, if this is this is who you are, this is who you are. Like, yeah, that's not a bad thing. No, yo. no. I mean, hey, I'm. I think, I think again, I think you have to be like, what what would it be for you to be in a great relationship and not be sexually satisfied? What would it be for you to be in a great sexual relationship, but y'all don't have anything else outside of that? Like. If you don't determine what your relationship is, go be with somebody, whether it be, you know, romantic or platonic or whatever, like you're gonna get the exact result of whatever you did not yeah. put into. So I mean, again, if that VP is like holler at me and you like that and y'all do that, and it's you know, you better fuck around be your night shining on. On the cover of Black Enterprise, like, hey y'all, hey, hey. I mean, I, I I, I I feel like a little bit before I let y'all go. I think there's like a misconception too uh, about certain things or things that how people want to date and what they require uh, to date. Um, and I was explaining to a friend as I I said, "Hey, I don't want to." split rent with somebody. I don't want to, that's, I don't want that to be a topic of discussion. I would want a man to be able to take the reins and the lead on that. Then I can contribute to the household in other ways. And even if that amounts to kind of like the same price, I'm okay with that, but I'm not splitting a rent or a mortgage unless financial situations change because then you're a roommate. And I feel that I don't need to shack up with somebody or do those certain things. If we're doing that, I'm going to be seeing other people too. But I feel like there is a man out there that is going to understand that and is going to be okay with that. Wait, like I said, I, the, the, with 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 the 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 being able to to, to pay the rent, I'm I don't have. Oh, oh I thought you were saying because that's because that's, that, like, because that's weird to me. Shit. Also, oh, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. So when we figure out what we're doing and we come as one, and that's that's those are the moves that we make it. We're gonna be making adult decisions, and I got on a homeboy about that, and I'm like, hey, you about to get married? 
you're not slitting that ring with that chick. And she was like, Afghani. And he was like, what do you mean? I'm like, you're not, I'm telling you, you're not going to be splitting the ring. Yes, we are. Do that nigga split the ring? No. Damn. Damn. So that's what I'm saying. Like, it's a certain way we talk about submission and mm -hmm. oh, women, black women, because y'all y'all never say it about others. Not y'all. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sorry, oh. sorry, sorry. Wait. Not y'all. Not y'all. But a lot of people, a lot of the Hotepi Kevin Samuel subscribers, I don't think that's true. I think the issue with the, the that whole conversation is a lot of men want old school tactics and characteristics to fall in line with their relationship, but they also don't take the lead um, and lead people. And that. that's on both ends. Some, you know, women, we are really, we are taught to be independent. We are taught to be able to stand on our own two feet because nothing is guaranteed and this nigga can leave you. So then, so, then, so then, okay, let's say he finds your. So he's just like, this ain't, he's like, I don't know this life. This ain't nothing about me because I leave shit over here. I ain't split no mortgage and blah, blah, blah. He's like, I don't know nothing about this life. I don't, no, okay. <laughs> I'm like, you want him to take the lead on the finances, but you want to peg him too? I'm like, it just was like, <laughs> Wait, right, but like, like I said, but see, but see, I didn't but say, see, but I didn't say necessarily my, and I said that's an experience that I wanted to have. I didn't say I wanted to have that with my husband. But if he want to get back, I mean, uh, what's I'm up? saying so. Okay, but, but okay. So as far as as far as this man said. This this night shine on with sexual preferences, like that, that's between y'all and what y'all talking about. But I'm talking about as far as you being an independent woman who is on her shit and handling her business and doing what she needs to do for herself and goals and shit like that. Like when does when does I guess it's a general question, not to you, but like when does the submissive part come in? Like, so I, I in my mind I imagine somebody tapping in with you, right? Physically, physically, whatever. But like, if you are already boom, 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 like you're looking for somebody to lead you where? Cause you're all, and I'm not saying I'm not saying he has to be alpha male. I am man, roar. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. But like, but like, where where does that man lead if you've already succeeded in different parts of your life? So there are the. Woo, that that's, was a a great, that's a great. That's a great. That's a great question, Aldoja. Let me respond. Thank you. I'm so um, good. I think that we all have certain boxes, and I think that when it comes to like relationships and love, I think that women want to be able to really exhale, mm. and I think that a lot of. At least in my my case, I can only speak for myself. I feel like sometimes it's hard for me to let go and let a man. I remember it's been a couple of times that men have told me that I feel like you don't need me. Mm. And I'm like, no, it's not that I don't like need you. It's just that I have to rem I have to show up for myself because mm. I can't rely on you and to provide happiness for me. So I have to be able to do that for myself. Now, if you want to come in and contribute to that happiness, I'm okay with that. But I also have a hard time sometimes, I believe trusting people, like trusting men. And I'm not, and it's, it has nothing to do. And, and then, which is weird because my dad, my dad shows up for me like crazy. My grandfather showed up for me. Mm. And so any moment where I feel like this nigga not going to come through, I have to come back around and save myself. And so I just take care of whatever it is that I could have potentially asked for and not giving this person a timeline. But I think that, so that's something that I'm working through and I understand mm. that. But I just feel for me, just how my dad provided and, you know, like that's my, that's my God. That's how my grandfather was. And I feel like dating in the 21st century has been very inconsistent. Mm. 
and my yeah. grandfather and my dad were not inconsistent. So that's yeah. been the biggest issue that I've had, whether I have been dating an athlete, a banker, whatever the case may be. And I'm like, am I inconsistent? Am I am I like a fucking girl? Like I have to check myself and see if I'm doing something that I could be, you know, attracting. Cause we have to be cognizant of that as well, dating. Right. Um, I, but yes. Well, I mean, I, I think that like so however Sleep, you, what? Sleep keeps shaking his head at me. I'm, I'm just listening. I'm I'm I'm, I'm I, 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 no, but like, hey, not, all, like, he's, like all he's doing is this is blender. In the blender. Hey man, listen. I didn't drink anything. I, you know. Oh uh, no, I'm, wait. I'm, I'm, I'm sober. I, I've been. Oh, no, no, I can't use twist. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, like, I'm like processing. The levels. I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, no, I'm just processing. Oh yeah, the different uh, levels. <laughs> the different levels of, of who you are you gonna ask him to talk, and then you're gonna talk over him? Me? Are you? Yes. Are you my fault. My fault. See, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. Okay. I, I am. Okay, no, no, it, it's cool. Okay. I'm super chill. Okay. So as I, I have been uh, married for eight years. Uh, I, me, me and my, me and my wife have been together for, for fourteen. So okay. we, we lived in St. Louis. We oh lived out of St. Louis. That was a dog. Okay, but so I gotta go I don't, see my baby today, dog. I can't fuck with y'all today. Okay. Okay, chill out. Yeah, I was. Yeah. I was, I was, I was, I was no, you know what? I was having a I'm a medium. Right? No, no, no. I, I, I got you. I got yeah. you. So no, but but let me say this. I will say this. Um, when it comes to like dating, and you think that you got the one or whatever, you are two people w- with different upbringings and different life situations coming together, and yes. you don't necessarily stop being yourself because you're with somebody. So if you were independent before you got with me, I cannot dim your light and and and, and try to overbear you. So traditional gender roles and some things doesn't necessarily apply. You got to do what, what, what works for you. Uh, when it comes to paying bills, when it comes to who makes decisions on we getting a new crib or we moving or we doing this, um, I believe more in a, in a partnership. I know when yeah. to leave. When it's time for me to put my foot down, it's time to leave. It, I know when to do that. But yeah. unless it's something that's like really going to cost a bunch of money or really going to put us in like a, a, a weird situation, I'm all about. We are two CEOs. We run a company. Our family is our company. We mm-hmm. need to fucking work together to come up with, with how this is going to work. That doesn't right. mean splitting everything or doing this. That just means before we make any major decisions or things that are going to impact us both, that we communicate and talk. Every relationship is going to be different. So I cannot say that Doja's relationship would have worked differently if he did what I did because he's not married. To, he wasn't married to the person that I, that I married. Exactly. So it's all about just find it's back full circle. Just finding the person that not necessarily checks all the boxes that you have or the certain I want this kind of guy. As long as that person checks the majority of them and is genuine, real, and does not put you in a situation where you feel like he's inconsistent, then things will work themselves out. Like I'm a firm believer in things work themselves out. That yeah. doesn't mean that you don't go to counseling. That doesn't mean that you pray on it. That doesn't mean that you meditate on it. Whatever you do to get your soul and your mind clear that you don't do that. But like, you can't have an expectation of somebody that you're dating that's going to take them away from the person that you fell in love with. If yeah. you was always outside and taking pictures on IG and all that, then I get with you and I want you to stop. I'm not letting you be your true self. That doesn't mean now that you we together that you just have your whole ass out either. Take your picture and put on something a little bit more modest if you want to. I need to still be comfortable, but there's got to be relationships don't have enough compromise. This is what I want, and this is what I need, and it's got to happen this way. Well, what about your mate and what he wants and what he needs or what she wants and she needs? So just, I guess the advice I can give, because I'm you know still in it, compromise. And I understand that's what you want, and I'm not telling you to get with a guy that's going to split the mortgage or split the rent. I ain't saying that. But like, if he don't want oh, to yeah. peg, then don't peg. Is all. I, first of all, hold on before I turn Doja Mike back on because he gonna cut me off. <laughs> I'm saying 
that that is real. an experience that I want to have at least no, no, once I, in I, my I, I life. I didn't say with my husband. Y'all not listening. Are you niggas not no, no. listening again? I said that. I, I clarified the statement for everybody. It was a joke. I know. I, was, I said I something know. that I was being all, <laughs> you know, all deep and and philosophical and whatnot, and I had to end it with some niggerish because I am a nigger. You did. You did. You did. But no, you will find the person, both of you all, if 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 you even want to be in that type of relationship with somebody, you will find the people that you deserve because good people eventually make that connection. Like yeah, and, and life is just trial and error. I was yeah. with a girl before I before I got with my wife. I was with a girl shit for seven years, and and we didn't stay together. That didn't mean I didn't just jump back out there and start back dating again either. Well, I started whoring, but I didn't start looking to to be with somebody. <laughs> But when it's time to calm down, you'll calm down. Yeah. And again, it doesn't mean that you're going to be perfect in your relationship. We are human. We fall short. Y'all just got to work it out. When you really yeah. care about somebody, you will you will build a bridge and you'll work it out. And if y'all can't build a bridge, that's probably not the person. So those of you, you, you just went through something. You may not feel stronger for it, but you are stronger for it. Because now you know what to look for on your next endeavor. And the guys who have been inconsistent with you, you know now the red flags. So when you meet that person that doesn't have those red flags, it's going to connect like Legos and y'all going to be straight. So just keep on dating and keep on living y'all lives, man. 40 and 34 ain't old. <laughs> it's not. Yes. It's really not. Like It's like, really like, not. It's really not. Now you like That's old niggas. Really so I mean, you it. might get a 50 year old so y'all can live like and have a long <laughs> relationship. If not, you're gonna keep getting older, like that nigga gonna age out, and then you have to find another old nigga. So that's not cool. That's you know what, but that that has happened. I think that that was one oh, of the yeah. issues that it, it it happened, it happened, and then it became it, it it started to like wreck his brain. And I'm like, why are we even having this conversation again? Oh my gosh, he didn't like when well, he was like, Well, you gonna be this age, I'm gonna be this age, and I'm like, okay. You was dating a nigga with Alzheimer's, or was he just he wasn't having about Alzheimer's? But <laughs> it was just like, you know what? People's insecurities show up in the weirdest way. That nigga said, "I'm gonna be ninety, and you are gonna be sixty, and you are gonna leave me for fucking Joffrey playing shuffleboard." That's what he said, and he ain't feeling that. That is what he pretty much said, yeah. but that ain't not, that's that's none of my business. So he said, "You gonna date me and take my money, and then get you a young sixty year old." When you 90 and now you're gonna be a sugar mama and he ain't feeling that. Like, <laughs> yeah, okay, what more vocals? <laughs> you can't Anyone. go, you can't go a sugar daddy to being a sugar mama. It's not that's not fair to the I, sugar daddy. It's ooh, it, it's so what <laughs> what 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 Beyonce say? I'm gonna be like the Charlie Ranger that you get from the corner store. I'm gonna be like a wild car. Just jumping down the what? street. Oh, what? 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 I'm in the what? hive. I'm in so, I'm I'm a part of the hive. I, you know, very masculine, but I love Beyonce. She can do no wrong. You don't have to listen. This platform, you don't have to prove your masculinity oh, no, no. on right. this show. This is a no, safe hey. space. If they play, this is a safe space. if we had karaoke and Beyonce on the list, I might sing Public Enemy or fucking NWA. I might fucking sing to the left. You just never know what the fuck's gonna happen. Depending on how many drinks I had. So I love Beyonce. Shout out to the Queen Bay, not B. I mean. Queen Bay. <laughs> uh, it's right. me, but okay. Uh, I'm notorious for doing partition at karaoke. Partition. Uh, partition. You do a love song. You do a song about man. I, I will. I, my go-to are partition, and then it'll have the intro to the Yonce, but then I'll do Rihanna's "Bitch Better Have My Money" to turn it up because it's just fun. It's just a fun song to do. Blend the baby. Oh my god! Anyway, oh, y'all, I didn't mean to even hold y'all this long. Whiskey sour is straight Hennessy, dog. Like it's a, <laughs> this is dark liquor. It is not whiskey sour. It is dark liquor. Straight no D A R K L I K K A. Dark liquor. That's, anyway, y'all. Can y'all let them know about your Amen. podcast and where they can find you like on? Questions. I just, ooh, what? Do I, what do you want to no, know? No, we got we to gotta, we gotta go. It's cool. We can, Doja, Doja, we'll schedule a bonus episode. You can ask your questions. Give me a question really quick. I will give you two seconds to answer. What's the question? 
So you got to think about it. You ain't have it. Uh, Where can uh, they find you on social uh, media, guys, whoa. and your, <laughs> your okay, podcast? Oh All right. Um, um, Aldoja and I have a podcast called Just Posted. Yeah. Yes. Um, it's not as we don't do all this, but we do talk about um talk about some shit. sports, we talk about what's going on in social media, we talk about law, we talk about a little bit of everything. It's very niggerish. Um it, it's a good time. So if you want to come and have niggerish antics, look up just post it. We are part of the straight out of low cash network, S O L C. Yes. Uh you can find me, I think my ex on there on Twitter yeah. at Gotta Go to Sleep. There's an underscore at the end. I had another page. It got hacks. Had a stalker. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was... Oh, yeah! Yo, you know, dang! Y'all yeah. see y'all live with that? The oh. with. You hey, yo, man. Hey, yo, dark hey. liquor, bro. Dark hey. liquor, bro. Hey. S-L-W-E. Dark liquor. She, she, she underscore. She, she, she ready to go a whole other hour. On Twitter. And you can find me at Got to Go to Sleep. On Instagram, I'm ignoring her. Um, yeah, it's it's. Uh, you want random ignorance? Follow me because I'm randomly ignorant, and I also have a poli sci degree, so I might talk about politics too. So, and I write pretty damn well as well. So, you know, fuck with your boy. <laughs> Hold on, before I take Doja off, I just want to say, oh my gosh, when I reacted to that, I'm sorry, that was a reaction because I na- I had forgotten all about that. That's fantastic and that you did that. Was, that. And that was, yes. And so we're just, <laughs> yes. Sleep had a crazy stalker and the stalker was stalking us. So that's all I'm going to say. Doja, oh, I'm yeah. going to She's, I she, it. yeah, me so you, that's. Me and you were friends on Twitter and she like reached out to you and was like, oh my God. And people, it, 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 social media it's is about, a strange place. And come on, it, it's about, this is how crazy this is. Me and Dominique have never done nothing. I'm talking about nothing. Not a picture, not a text message, nothing. We would just be cordial with each other on social media because we know each other in real life. Yes. My stalker, any girl I had, that I had a conversation with, she went through all my conversations. She reached out to like 55 chicks. And all the chicks was like, you've been nothing but a gentleman with me. I don't know what she's talking about because I wasn't even on that. I wasn't even being, I wasn't even Yo, on that. My home girl, when I when, once I realized what was happening and I like just went off on her. My like, home girl husband, that. my home girl husband was like, hey, Dom, get the other Dom, because she tripping on line. She cussing somebody out. And I'm like, hey, you got my boy messed up. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And so I, I went to I went to bat. I am so happy to have a tribe of female friends. <laughs> That I really wasn't on nothing with. Like that's the, what's the what the crazy part was. Yeah. Like I'm not saying I'm perfect. I I have been a scoundrel in my life, but at that point of my life, I wasn't being a scoundrel. All right. Yeah. Was it. You were so, not. I appreciate you for going to bat for me because that was crazy. Yeah. I'm talking about. I, <laughs> and, and you're looking at me and you're like, you had a stalker. Yes, niggas and women who are watching this. My regular smegular living in a fucking house in the suburbs ass had a damn stalker. I'm talking about going to court, restraining orders, two of them. Shit was crazy. Oh yeah. if, if I wrote yeah. a movie, niggas would think I was lying. So I just don't even talk about it for real. But yes. yeah. Anywho, yeah. you gotta go to go sleep. Underscore. They took my old page because she hacked it and they won't give it back to me. Twitter, give me that back my cool. old page. All right. Black Power. And, and, Doja. Fuck, and fuck Kyle Rittenhouse and his crying ass Louis Anderson looking mama. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I apologize. Hey, um, <laughs> oh, so, oh my goodness, though, it's like so, like, because it's levels of different guys, but then, like, if these, like, what happens if, like, the boy, if you don't get your damn social media, I, you, you, you're right, you're right, because he still uh, ain't got the question ready, nah, yeah, it's, it's, had a whole it's, 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 sleep and it- it's, a, it's a it's a question, but it's A, B, C, and D, like, it's like. Bro, okay, I'm gonna go meet me on my live tomorrow. I'm gonna go live man, after Insecure. Instagram. It's a lot. So okay. it's just uh my uh Instagram is my name. It's just like uh what's the, the little what's it called? It's like the underscore underscore. There we go. It's an underscore. I couldn't think because I, I got this. It's, it's in my I got this underscore between each letter. So D underscore O underscore S 
Underscore I underscore A. Doja. That's it. That's it. That's it. Oh yeah. And uh let me we actually have an Instagram for our podcast that he forgot it's to plug. Ugly. It's just just posted. J U S T P O S T E D. Um you can find out about some of the dates Doja has gone on. We talk about this random what? Shit, the... No, <laughs> it's, 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 it's okay. Listen, Doja. Oh, hey, it's hey, fine. Hey, it's podcast. That was like the first check out. episode. This oh, the episode. Made this girl paid Dutch on a date. Y'all got to watch it and, 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 and you got to see it. Oh, yes, and, and every I, and I actually now have a podcast on the SOLC, uh, SOLC network. Uh, it's called Every Everyone Needs an Aquarius, and it is with Daryl. You do, aka, you yes, got two Oh, no, no, yeah, no, yeah, and I might have a third one yeah, in the works. Yeah, so uh, Daryl and I have a, a monthly podcast. Well, and, uh, because family. it is two, yes, thank you, two Aquariuses. Um, the latest episode just dropped yesterday. I'm um, looking at it tonight. It is hilarious. We talk about everything. Uh, I can't wait to do the next episode because somebody sent in a question for us already. And um, so Why that's you it. Those she can have more, more than one podcast. No, 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 no. Yeah, <laughs> no, and I might, I might, and I'm. I, I might have it, uh, depending yeah, on, you know, the latest episode I'm going to drop of this one. Hopefully things will be, you know, like on the up and up too, you know. So we all trying to make money moves out here, baby. It's enough for all of oh, us to get it. Next time you go live talking about Insecure, I might have to hop on there. because I'm Tomorrow, gonna... I'm going to do, I'm going to start doing it every week after the show. Because I, I, I am 100% I am Team Lawrence to the death. To the... I, you know what? I, I... <laughs> We so so tomorrow. Okay, I'm gonna go live Death. after the episode tomorrow. Issa don't know I, what you got. Issa, sorry, Issa don't know. Send that man brother. a text. How you gonna send that man a text talking about some? Yeah, you just had a baby. What the fuck is like? That don't make no sense. We to you, we dog. okay. So what? we gonna so live. Okay, like so that will be what nine thirty. Like Lawrence deserves. A wonderful black oh, queen. Oh, and that was before me. y'all even got together. How you gonna tell I was, me? I was, I'm gonna say this. I, I will say I'm not mad at Issa for not wanting to be a part of the baby mama drama. Um, That's fair. She I, wouldn't have cheated and they would still be together. We we can talk about it on live. Do it on live. Uh, yes, we can do it on live. Oh, I got a question. I have a question. I have a question. Yes. Oh, so we got to go. We got to record. You know, go and go. Oh, yeah. I thought y'all did y'all podcast before. No, no, no. It didn't happen that way. We, okay. We, listen, so, we wanted so, to make so sure we had so enough time gave? to do to do this. Gotcha. Okay. I didn't mean to hold you for two you hours. I was only trying you to did, have you y'all for an hour. So so if 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 you're if you're dating somebody, right, and he's of mm-hmm. a certain stature, what mm-hmm. happens if he if he keeps up the leadership-esque about him, but like his financial structure changes. Then what? Do you stay with that person, or do you go find somebody else? Who no, is- I no, I so see not listening. I t- I said that didn't I sleep? I said she so. Did. Those conversations can be revisited if we need to have to adjust. I have no problem um, having to step up and take care of household if that's something that we need to do, and you know if I have to do. But it, I. I am a team player. I don't want it just to be like, oh, you got to buy me a, a Dior bag and you got to do this and this and that. It's not about that. We, It is like Sleep said, like we are two people coming together. We are building a foundation together and we have to be able to coexist and work together. Uh, even if it's a situation with a dog, a kid, you, you know, you're building something with somebody. So we do have to compromise. I think a lot of people don't compromise, but I also think people don't have those conversations prior to walking down the aisle with somebody. And so that's where you have a lot of issues that come into play because you didn't talk about it. Well, so see. with that being said, Please be sure to like, subscribe, and share the podcast. Please subscribe to the, you know, the SOLC network. C, D, and E for that question, but it's cool. We're going to hold hold them. And be sure to buy some candles from your girl at saint-angelus.com slash candles. I might have a scent or two coming out for the holiday. That's in addition to the line. So, yeah. 
It's the perfect I, gift to give. I'm so, so sorry. y'all. Ha- what? I just realized St. Louis, Angeles, St. Angeles, just now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, fused, I have fused my worlds together. Hey, a West Side girl living in 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 in, in California. Oh, yeah, West yeah. Side girl living on the West Coast. Yes. Hey. So I want to thank y'all so much for coming on the show, thank and I us. definitely want to have y'all back. Uh, those just save your questions because we can do a follow up. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. It's all good. I'm cool. Okay. Just on the next okay. one. Yeah. I'm gonna let. I want y'all to be it, and I can moderate. Cause I, 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 I ain't got nothing to do with Listen, it. What, uh, <laughs> I, well, the topics today, like it literally, they were inclusive. Like I, I wanted them to be inclusive, but then it just, it took a turn. And it's, those are things that happen. And like, like I was like, okay, good. We started with the sports. So this is going to be great. We all talking. Yeah. And then and, it just, And I messed you know, up earlier. Those y'all told you to, to text her, don't. Cause she might screenshot it. So just call her. Hey man, it's all. Uh, listen, I stand on mine, bro. I'm a grown ass man. I'm I, I, look, man. I look. Yes, yes, yes. I, I learned. It's all good. Y'all, y'all made it seem like I'm this terrible ass person. I'm wholesome. I'm wholesome. Never said that. Said Never said that. And that's it. Yes. I don't judge people. I don't judge right. people. I just right. let people. Just right. hey. I'm easy to find. If anybody has any questions about whatever, I'm easy to find. I'm easy to find. Ask me. What was you All thinking? Right. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye. Thank you for having us. <laughs>